her age of life, it's quite normal for them to be able to um, do the checks that they've said that they've been doing. Um, the fact that they've released her so quickly um, is really positive, you know, that she's back at home, she's recovering, um, and that everything's fine. She is tough, right? Um, I was flying over yesterday and we got the news just as we were getting on the plane and my wife pointed it out to me and said she's 95 and she's resisting going to the hospital. That's a tough broad, as we say in America. I think she's extremely healthy. I mean, she's still riding horses, she's still going out. Um, she's very independent, so I think, you know, she's a very strong lady. Um, she's got a lot of support around her, uh, but equally so, you know, 95. She's now with a walking stick as well, so you can tell she's getting a little bit fragile, but still, she's very, very strong. <laughs> the family has got uh, genes where, you know, her mother was, was very old when she died, over 100. Um, you know, but I mean, People like that have a very easy life, don't they? And they have very good food and uh, live in luxury, so probably that's one of the reasons why they live so long.